Welcome to Lavanya's computer classes. In this video, I will explain JNTUH-R-rated M1 important questions. Every student who must fail M1 is very tough. That's why I will give the important questions in unit wise. So first unit one, unit one is matrices. So in the unit one, what are the important question means eclons, normal forms, Hermitian, skew Hermitian. If you read these questions, compulsory one question is coming from this chapter. The unit one, at least two questions are coming from unit one. So in this one question is compulsory coming from this topics. Eclans, normal forms, Hermitian, screw Hermitian and its properties. And also um, in this Eclan we have to find out rank problems. So very very important question. Compulsory one question is coming from in this question. So one question means 15 marks because it is a corona pattern. So 15 marks here easily get good marks in these topics. Next one is Gauss elimination, Gauss Seidel, Gauss Jordan methods. In this using these methods find inverse and system of linear equations. These are also important question. That's why if you are uh, getting if it is corona pattern that's why you are getting two questions from these units also. That's why most concentrate on unit 1 and unit 2. And in the unit 1 homogeneous system and non-homogeneous system. These questions also coming from the unit 1. So in the unit 1 these are the very very important question. At least one question is coming from these topics also. Eclan, normal forms, Hermitian, screw Hermitian. Next, then unit 2. In the unit 2, what is the important questions means? Cali-Hamilton theorem. Very important question. Using Cali-Hamilton theorem, problems are coming. In these problems also, how to inverse problems and calculation of A power. So, these problems are coming from Cali-Hamilton. Next one is Huygen values and Huygen vectors. Problems. These are not theory, actually these are eigenvalence and eigenvector theorems, but theorems are not their problems. These are also very, very important question. And one more thing is reduced quadratic to canonical forms. These are also important question. If you are read this unit 1 and unit at least it is possible to write three questions. So more concentrate on unit 1 and unit 2. These are the important questions. Next then unit 3. In the unit 3 sequences and series in the sequences and series all the theorems are less, uh, learn like uh, comparison test and p test comparison test for p test for all these four first one is d alambert ratio rabis test logarithmic test and Koch is nth root test for these four we are compulsory use comparison test and p test important then unit four small one only in these also mean value theorems the mean value theorems, no theorems are there, all are the problems only. Rolls, Cauchy's, Taylor's and Lagrange's problems. In these also one question is compulsory coming from these. Next unit 5 that is partial differentiation and applications. In this learn maximum and minimum, Jacobian, Euler's, total difference, finite dependency. In these also compulsory one question is coming. If you read these compulsory you get easily get good marks in M1. See this again. The unit 1 and unit 2 most concentrated on unit 1 and unit 2. In these only we get easily 4 questions. Otherwise at least minimum 3 questions are coming. Unit 1 and unit 2. And these are it. Whatever the lines I write it in the red pen. Those are very very important questions. At least 1 or 2 questions are coming from these topics. So these are the important questions in your M1. Read well and write well. Thank you for watching my video. Subscribe my channel. Share it to your friends and thank you.